Hey guys, thank you for joining me today on this Vodia speed training. Uh, today will be um, pretty quick. It's a simple feature, um, hasn't been really talked about yet. Um, I'm talking about the ACD numbers, and this is found in the last tab of the call queue. Okay, so basically what you can do here or the scenario would be if you have 20 agents for example um, or even remote agents and so what you can do here is you can add a number a DID number uh, a name and a comment in an audio file and I'll show you what how to get this prepared so you can click the add button you can add the number which is this will be the DID number the name of the client and the comment that you want to add okay so here's an, exa here's an example I'm going to call in to the system right now I have um, I have all these agents logged in if I go back to numbers and just dial uh, I'm going to dial uh, Dr. Kelly's number So the agent will hear the ringing when you answer the call. Incoming call for Dr. Kelly. Before you hang up, we would like to get your feedback. So two things are happening here um, when the agent answers the call. One is, is that they see the name on the display of the desktop phone. And they also hear a short message. Um, on how to answer the call. So right now I have two, I have Dr. Kelly, Dr. Altman. I'm gonna add another one so you guys can see how it looks. So I'm gonna go to my Skytel. I have a few numbers here. So I'm gonna take this one. And so let me make sure my endpoint is correct. Yep, everything looks good. So now I'm gonna go back here, click add, add my number. And this one would be, uh, Let's see, I'm just going to put Dr. Ann and Dr. Office. And let's upload an audio file. In this case, it will be Dr. Arthur. Okay. And then press create. Now I added a new number, a new customer information and how to answer um, how to answer the call I can you can go in and edit as well so okay and save now if I call in that number nine seven eight three zero zero seven eight four um, the agent will hear a ringing Incoming call for Dr. Aldor. Before you hang up, we would like to get... So then the agent will hear the audio and play the message. You can also make um, any uh, DID here, primary identity to the uh, call queue, like this. And if you go to edit, then you'll see here that we have set that number to be the, the primary. Obviously, this is the, ex the account number of the outbound of the uh, extension account queue rather you can see a lot of numbers you can get uh, confused but so let's put this back to primary and then we can go back and then assess it to primary so um, let's add one more I'm gonna also show you how to convert an audio file I use um, Amazon Polly for this just to create a short blurb of message for the agent so I'm gonna say Incoming call for, uh, let's say, the Rodia. And i um, just going to download it. I know how it sounds. So I'm going to download the file. And I'm going to say Dr. Rodia. Put this on my desktop. Save it. And then I'm going to open it with my... Um, another thing... Um, before you even convert this file, make sure there's no spaces in between. Uh, then uh, the phone system will reject 
um, the file. So I'm going to open this with wave pad. You're not seeing that? Okay, let me see. Let me see what we can do here. Let's stop sharing. And then let's share. Start sharing. Let's see, window. Uh, let's see if it shows it. It'll be cool if it shows my the application. Uh, yeah, I guess it doesn't. Anyways, um, let me convert the file real quick. Basically, you want to save the file. You want to save it as... So when you have an MP3 file, you want to save it as WAVE. Okay? Uh, the encoding and most... Um, Editors, wave editors have this. The encoding would be PCM. Just leave it as PCM. The channel is mono, right? Because it, it's a, it's a, just one earpiece you're listening. The sample rate is 8,000 kilohertz. And the sample size or bits is 16 bits. So I'm going to save this. Okay. So I'm going to go and click add. This will be, um, let's add a number. Let's go to my Skytel. Let's grab a number here. Okay, this is this is just a different way of using the ACDQ. So there's a number name. This will show up. Just put biz and then choose a file. Dr. Vodia. And then create. You can play the files, of course. So let's call that number. Uh, that would be 3007912. There's the call. Incoming call for Dr. Vodia. Okay, and then, um, so again, the agent will hear that audio file. Um, the customer that's calling will not. They will just hear a ring back. And then, of course, the agent will answer the call accordingly. So that's how the, the numbers work. I know it's a, kind of a, a obscure. Nobody really talks about it, but I, I thought it was a good topic to, to cover because um, this means now that you can use this for, for multiple uh, purposes now. I mean, uh, it's not just a plain uh, call queue. Now you can add something more. Um, very versatile uh, feature and um, you guys can go ahead and test it. This will be recorded. I mean, this is being recorded rather uh, be available and you guys can test it. Uh, I'm using version 16 um, and you can go and do your testing. Uh, the next um, speed training for next month, I want to cover outbound calling. That's another neat feature as well. Um, but for now, we're going to sign off. I hope you guys enjoyed this session. I'm going to look to the right to see if there are any questions I can answer. Um, unless I know German, which, which I don't. Um, but if you guys have any questions, um, if you guys can write it in English, you can send it to support at vodia.com or you can go to our forum as well forum.vodia.com i encourage you guys to go here as well there's a lot of rich information you guys can use when operating your phone system and of course uh support.vodia.com you can register uh with zamad and uh we'll be able to yeah. to help out thank you Stuart. uh it was a pleasure always a pleasure working with you all right um we will reconvene next month and i hope you guys take care and uh, be safe <laughs>